Is this thing on? What is up guys? My name is Changer Danger. This is Brainy. Welcome back to the vlog channel. We have a special video today. We are doing a review of this product. It is the Pro Shot case. We've used this before a couple times. Um, I've also done I've also done video reviews of phone cases on my channel. And so when these guys hit me up, I was like, yeah, definitely let's do it. Um, so we're going to give you guys an honest review. They did send us the product and then uh, give us a little bonus, but um, I don't like fake reviews or pumping up a product that's not good. So we're going to take this out to the water, put it to the test and see if this is a good phone case for your dive. She's not letting me talk in this video. I what guess. are we going to talk about? Well, we can still make it vlog style. You're making it like your style video. Oh uh, yeah, I guess. <laughs> I was gonna talk to them for a second and be like, Okay, go for it, Britt. Well, guys, I just woke up. It's like 6.45. Okay, I woke up at 6.45, it's like seven now. And we were gonna go dive this morning and do all this, but we have some exciting life update house stuff that we have to do this morning. So we're gonna unbox this now and then we're gonna go dive and test it out for sunset, sunset dive kind of vibe. Um, but we're not vlogging what we're doing today, so just stay tuned. In a couple of videos, you'll find out if you don't know what I'm talking about already. So. Okay, I just realized I accidentally fully unboxed it while Brittany was talking. So I'm going to undo all of the things that I've just done. What the heck? <laughs> Sorry. Uh, okay, so were these in the package or out of the package when we got it? Um, they were in a, a separate box okay. where it was like squishy. Okay, so these are probably um, like pay extra type things. There are some filters. Uh, so that's the first thing that I found when I opened it up because um, we, we already did the box, obviously. Um, and then so it comes with these uh, filters. You can see now we are magenta. Um, so yeah, it comes with three filters. And they're Next. plastic. And uh, about filters... <laughs> <laughs> they don't care that much about the filters. <laughs> right. that I, I don't think the magenta filters are good for anything, so don't buy a magenta filter, but I don't know, maybe you want to try it out. Maybe you have different luck. I don't like magenta filters. I don't like any of them because at the surface it's too red. It's yeah. like more for scuba diving. Yeah, I feel that's, like. that's definitely a scuba diving thing. Okay, so I just unboxed it again without showing it to you guys, so this time I'm going to show it to you. Uh, hopefully yeah. nothing falls out. It's all dark anyway. <laughs> Okay, whatever. Yeah, just take it out and show them. Okay, so they come with this float stick. It's kind of like the float stick that we use for the GoPro. Uh, so nice that they have their own proprietary one. Uh, this is the screw to attach yeah, the phone Yeah, so they got the screw with it and then it looks like a securing piece. Um, and then all that's left in here is the phone case. And it's got this foam stuff on it. Maybe that helps it float. Do you, what do you think that's for? Well, yeah, that's weird. Kind of weird, right? The other one to have... It didn't have that. It had a design like this, but not made out of foam. So I yeah. guess I should be showing you. Yeah, it feels kind of cheap, to be honest. Okay. So, uh, yeah, I don't know. I mean... Um, Just that part, not the whole case. Yeah, the whole case feels pretty solid, though. And then this is probably... Because I have, like, a really expensive dive case. It's, like, 200 bucks. So I'm guessing that this one is... A lot less than that and so this is sort of like the um for the type of person that doesn't want to spend a crazy amount of money on their phone case but can still go scuba diving with it I'm trying to open it to show you guys i because we <laughs> do you them, want to let me try to open it we worked with them before and if uh, one case Fits like multiple phones, so it's good if you are in like a household with different people with phones because there's like an insert that it comes with, so you can either take the insert out or put the insert in to fit the phone. See, it's not okay, yeah, it's kind of confusing. <laughs> okay, so yeah, it looks like it's got a spring loaded insert, and then there's also this uh info sheet inside that I bet if we read it, we would know how to actually open the case instead of uh ripping it apart like monkeys. Um, you don't have your phone on you. BRB. Hey, no dancing. <laughs> this is a phone review, not a dancing vlog. <laughs> All right, so I got my phone, took its protective case off of it as an iPhone 11 uh, Pro Max or whatever. Um, and then you kind of just Shove it in there. Shove it in it's there, push it against the spring, and then the lenses are clear there. Make sure you wipe your lens with and your shirt if before you, have you go. The newer iPhones that are bigger, I think you just stick the whole phone in here. No, I think it still goes in there. Look, there's oh. space. 
Yeah, with the old case, bigger. with the old case, you just didn't use an insert. So yeah, you just raw dog the phone. You just slid it in this, and this is cool because it's uh, all like hard plastic. So hopefully, it can't like interface any of the touchscreen while you're underwater. Yeah, I don't think you can. Looks okay, like and then the the lens on this looks like it's also acrylic and not glass or anything. Um, so just in case you guys are okay, you don't have to put it all the way in. Interested in the materials. Okay, and then one more thing that they told me before we go is to make sure that you have the ProShot case app downloaded oh, yeah. because you can't interface the screen at all and so you will not be able to use your phone. It looks like there's also no lock so you don't have to worry about accidentally locking it. However, if your phone is getting low and you wanna save the battery for a minute, you can't. So make sure your phone is fully yeah. charged before you go have the ProShot case app and then load it in properly without any problems on the gasket and let's stop talking and go to no. the water. And one more tip I have. Whoa, whoa, yeah. whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. Um, put your phone in airplane mode when you take it underwater because oh, yeah. it'll be searching for a signal the whole time and it'll drain your battery so quickly. You'll be like, what the heck? I take pictures all the time. It doesn't drain this fast. So uh, put it in airplane mode before you get in the water because otherwise it's going to be like searching and your battery just like <clears throat> dead. Yeah, yeah. So do that. Yeah. You don't have to, but you should. No, you should. Okay, so <laughs> is that all of our tips? Uh, we're ready to go? Yeah, let's go. But okay. We're going to go later, but in yeah. vlog time, it'll be the next Yeah, clip. we're going right now, so let's go. <laughs> We've had a long day, and the AC is broken in my truck, so getting here was... Uh, Sweaty. Hellish. Sweaty. Yeah. Um, like, because driving this way, you get the sun, like, beating on you. Why is there someone e-foiling here? Mm -hmm. I better not get run over by an e-foil while I'm snorkeling. Oh, and then there's our friend Jill. Oh. Anyways. Hi, Jill. Uh, we are sweaty. I was in the sun <laughs> the whole drive here. What? No, we didn't get in yet. We just got here. Oh. Are you going to go in? Are you still going in? Have fun. <laughs> All right, so they're doing some weird scuba they thing. They said it looks bad. Yeah, there's a guy e-foiling, which is like, why There's literally you... no one diving. Oh, it's the guy with the sailboat. Well, anyways, better not get run over by this e-foil or I'm suing. Um, <laughs> and uh, is this part of the Pro Shot case video or is this something else? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, so, so we have this. We're about to go jump in. I think we're going to use my phone. But we're filming with my phone now, so I was gonna put it in the case, but I can't. Okay, right? yeah, to keep it all on one thing. Yeah, so. Well, no, because I have the app already on my phone. True. Okay, mm -hmm. so we're gonna use Britt's phone. It's already got the app, so it's good to go. Um, and then we're gonna go test it out. I'm gonna try to. Hopefully, the water is. You can see something. I'm worried they said it was really bad. Maybe they don't know. But they uh, kind of died. I know. <laughs> we're so sweaty! Um, yeah, we need to go in the water either right, way. Let's get out there.
with it down there holding it and then we'll do a couple videos where we just use it like how we did before and you guys can see what it looks like. Thank you. 
guys, we just made it back to the car. Why is there so much in there? Okay. Um, <laughs> so, so we, we, have a lot of we things haven't to gotten say. to look at the footage yet, so that's the very first thing. Um, Britt was saying she likes it better than the GoPro. Well, it's more blue, but that's just the iPhone. So we're just talking about the case. Yeah. Oh, so why do you like the case better? Oh, I mean, I just like the iPhone. I don't know. Yeah, it's it's like nice to be able to use your phone. Like you're probably already comfortable with filming with your phone. And then it's so, already on the phone. You don't have to transfer it. So that's a yeah, plus also. Yeah, there, so um, like I feel like the comparison footage, this versus a GoPro, it's like useful if you have the two and you're trying to decide what to use. But it's t two totally different types of users that would typically be making this choice. So it's like <clears throat> either you're someone who is like going on a trip and you just want to use your phone. You want something cheap to put it in. Not like cheap, cheap, but cheaper than buying a GoPro or professional camera. Um, and then you are, are like looking for this type of solution. Then this thing is for you. Um, it looks really nice so far. Like I, yeah, yeah, like he said, I didn't look back on the footage when we were filming it. And also the water was way clearer than we thought it was going to be. So that was like a really good plus. And, and almost any camera can take good quality video underwater when the water's clear. If you have That's really true. murky water, yeah. the footage doesn't look that good. So yeah. it partially because the water was so nice out there is why the footage looks really good. But yeah. um, the phone case did great. It, I, I mean, I didn't use that as much as him, so he can talk about it more, but it didn't like press buttons. It was really easy to use the app. You just clicked through the options with one volume button and then the other volume bu button would start the video and that's like pretty much all you need um or take takes the like five minutes to figure out how to use it super easy and doesn't do wonky things like stays an app doesn't open other apps yeah. on your phone like no lots wonk. of other cases do that if you've used underwater phone case you know what i'm talking about if you don't then it's hard to explain but just yeah. it starts doing crazy things you underwater. don't want to use one where you if if you can interface the screen most of the time no it's every bad. time it's always bad no the dive volk one works fine because that uh, has a special thing okay i feel like when you still bring it up and out it does weird things okay um but yeah so uh really cool case uh i think we both recommend it for someone who doesn't have a gopro but wants to try taking underwater photo video um and we were also wrong about the pink filter oh my god the pink, the pink filter, filter was epic so <laughs> so so the times when i would not use the pink filter basically would be if i'm gonna go shoot surf or like if we're at a water park and i wanted to take this on a water slide that kind of thing where you're not filming underwater but as soon as you go underwater, you want to put the pink filter on and put I didn't it, actually put it, it inside of the case. Don't put yeah. it on the outside. So we didn't put it in the case this time. There's a special spot to put it inside the case. We wanted to be able to see it without because we thought we weren't going to like it. So that's why we, we just wanted to test held it. it in front. So it works fine like that. Like it's no big deal, but that's not how you're supposed to use and it. That's why it fell off while we were recording sometimes. Yeah. We just wanted to be able to show the difference with and without it. So that's why we did it like that. But if we were to bring the phone case out again, I would probably just tell him to put the pink filter in yeah automatic because we don't film anything above water pretty much um but yeah so there's a link for uh the pro shot dive case that's specifically what we were reviewing they have other cases this was the dive case um link in the description if you want to go get one uh we may have a coupon code but we we, we at least have a link um which helps them track that it came from us so go check it out with that link if you want to uh invest in one of these for yourself for your underwater adventures yeah i mean it's, it's my favorite phone case that we've used underwater so oh. far okay oh i don't like ones that you can touch the screen so for me i like this one best if i was gonna bring my phone out i would take this one um Honest yeah, review. The, this is my, my, for the price, I would say this is my number one pick. There is one that I like better, but it's like two or three hundred dollars. So, um, so at that point, just get a GoPro. <laughs> yeah, totally. Uh, but yeah, so really cool case. Thanks to Pro Shot for sponsoring this video and sending us the case to try out. Um, and, and yeah, that's the honest review on it. Yep. So now the sun has set and we're going to go home and eat dinner oh, and finally. this vlog is going to be over and we'll yeah. see you guys in the next one. So make sure you comment down below, like this video, smash subscribe if you're not already subscribed. I also have my own channel. If you didn't know, go check out my channel 
and our channel is popping off wait 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 and <laughs> if you want to see more product reviews like this leave a comment below or if you are a product then contact us have a have a human contact us not the actual product and that's, that's all, all the stuff we saw, we saw. bye, bye.